Well, hello, Dora. Are you ready to get something done around the homestead today? Well, let's take a little look and see what project we've got going on. We've had to replace some hydraulic lines on the swing cylinders on the 555A Ford backhoe. And these spots here where the bushings are is where the trunnions fit that the cylinders react in order to manipulate the boom from left to right. We had a busted line on one cylinder and regretfully to get to the busted line the whole cylinders had to come out. So instead of repairing one line since you've got to go through taking your top plate out and removing both cylinders it was just prudent to go ahead and remove both cylinders, repair both lines, and make a thorough inspection of the two swing cylinders. And went ahead and repaired them and had them rebuilt while they were out. And as you can see, they're pretty big and pretty heavy. And they're double acting. You have oil that'll flow through on one side. And at the same time it's flowing through, this line will hook up to the other cylinder and vice versa and it gives you a piston type result on both cylinders while you're manipulating the swing control on the machine. So we went ahead and pulled the trunnions, rebuilt the cylinders and then put the trunnions back on and these trunnions go in where the bushings are that we just referred to on the lower bracket of the machine itself and there's the top plate that we discussed that bolts across and holds both of these cylinders in place so they can perform their double acting positions. I'll get everything set up and start putting them in place and give us a little update as to what we've done. And remember when you're doing things like this always go ahead and invest in some good rubber gloves and things to protect your hands because grease and oil and diesel fuel is carcinogenics.